Kelly here from Lardner's Trailer Sales. This is the Sport Trek 327 bunk model travel trailer. This is one of our best selling trailers and it is loaded with reasons why. And we started right here because this is where the fun is. You're out here, you're getting supper ready for the kids. They're out there playing in your campsite and you can be out here with them while you're preparing supper. We're going to show you a lot of things on this trailer and we're going to start here at the back. First of all, barbecue, it's stored away, and stove, not one or the other. Cargo rack, fold down ladder. Fridge, stove I mentioned, hot and cold running water, DVD player and TV. So you can have movie night outside. A lot of fun. And of course, storage and if you just want music, that's there. Now here's one of those durability issues. Lots of outside kitchens out there. This has got a metal slide out tray. They were making them out of the cabinet material. The problem is it's outside. It gets moisture. It swells. It has to be changed. You don't want to have that. More durability issues. This has the NGX huck bolted frame. In short, it's better engineered, it's stronger, it's got better camber, it's just an all around better frame. Your frame is your foundation. You don't want to take a shortcut there. Did you notice these awnings? No arms. They are armless awnings and they even have wind sensor on them. So if you forget to put them away, you go to the beach, gets too windy, zip, in they go. Two of them with lights. Speaking of lights, this has, it's here somewhere, I saw the reflection. It's got these blue lights underneath here. There's blue light, night lights underneath the trailer. So at night you can see around the trailer not having to carry a flashlight all the time. More lights. This light here in your baggage compartment, that's motion detector. So you just leave it on. When you open this, the light comes on. Now you can see stuff. And a battery disconnect. So your battery's not going dead all the time because that's a common problem in RVs. Electric front jack. Aluminum pet friendly steps so they won't hurt their nails. Let's go inside. Bedroom up here for mom and dad has a couple neat features. They've gone to the longer mattress now so you've got a residential length mattress and look at the nightstands behind the closets with 110 volt plug-ins on both sides and USB charging back there. Of course all the lights are LED. Private entrance into the bedroom for mom and dad or the bathroom sorry and you've got a porcelain foot flush toilet you've got a glass roller door uh, shower Dustin's gonna come around here the sink and vanity are behind the door can you get in here Dustin there we go so you got good storage here decent sized sink good sized shower and look at that storage in there they move things around from last year that last year we didn't have this they redesigned the trailer a little bit to give you a little more storage because you can never have enough storage up here in the kitchen really well designed island kitchen stainless steel sink double bowl lots of storage and counter space because you got the island you got this counter here and of course you got space beside the stove it's not a listed option. We bring ours in with eight cubic foot refrigerators. They come with a standard with a six. But this is a bunk model. You need food. And it, you need lots of fresh food. And you got lots of storage in here. So put your drinks out there and you can get everything you need in here. Man, have you got storage in that chilled storage. And big pantry here. Now, that's the necessary stuff. It's fun stuff. I mentioned sometimes you're out there cooking and the kids are playing in the campsite. The windows are on the campground side so you're looking at your kids not the neighbor kids and you're looking at your campsite not the neighbor's campsite. Really well designed and we've got a trifold hide a bed so that if you've got guests that aren't sleeping with the kids in the bunk room they've got a proper bed to sleep on. <clears throat> now there's a lot of talk about dinettes. This is a booth style dinette. A lot of people say I want the U-shaped dinette. Have you ever looked at the size of a table on a, a U-shaped dinette? It's probably about that big. 
then you get adults if you get four people sitting around there on a u-shaped dinette is there room for your feet under there probably not this has been around for a long time it's a good design there's a reason it's been around for a long time it works now back to movie night you're not having movie night outside tonight you're having it inside because you got this another great big tv fireplace dvd player and while you're sitting here you need the remote oh which remote do i need do i need the tv one for the tv the one for the stereo or the one for the pi oh wait a second it's all the same remote one remote runs all three very well designed the bunk room for the kids is also well thought out big wide bunk up here normal size bunk here storage underneath depends how many kids you got that makes out to a bed and if you need another bed that makes out to a bed you got lots of sleeping in here and then if you got a day with a it's not so nice outside and the kids need to do some activities inside there's a table that goes there it's just so they've got their own space to play and do things and of course speaking of things the kids have things and you got to store it somewhere so there's more room under the bed but also of course this closet 327 sport trek vik the best design bunk model travel trailer on the market and at the best price come see it at lardner's trailer sales or in ottawa drive north in saskatoon online at lardner's.com